seeing a little bit of reflectivity there on the pavement. Uh, had some showers move through storms just off to the west. Checking in with current temperatures, we are warm. Mid 60s to the mid 70s. Lincoln still reporting some rain, 75. Epley reporting dry conditions, mostly cloudy for Omaha, 66 Harlan. And uh, if you are in Iowa today, we are seeing an air quality range from moderate to unhealthy, especially in central and eastern Iowa. So air quality alert in effect for Iowa throughout the day today. Now let's get into this morning storms. Live dual pole super Doppler starting to see some lightning off to our west. Just starting to now move on into Douglas County as we work our way out toward Utan, Fort Calhoun, Missouri Valley, and on into Cass and uh, Odo County, Syracuse. Further south, seeing quite a bit of lightning, nothing severe this morning, and expecting those to move out here within the next few hours, giving way to lots of sunshine here today. We do need the rain, so we will take any storms that we get this morning. But this afternoon, concern then turns to the heat. 95 degrees by 4, feeling like 100. But with a high of 96 today in Omaha, Lincoln, be feeling as hot as 101. Even hotter further south, Beatrice, 97, 89, Carroll, Atlantic. But that humidity a little bit higher. Definitely, once again, wanting to uh, stay hydrated, stay cool, check on your friends, neighbors. As we head into storm predictor throughout the morning, those storms move off, seeing more bright, strong sunshine for your afternoon. Your drive home this evening is still looking pretty good. Lots of sunshine, downright hot and sweaty, though, overnight tonight and into early tomorrow morning. Another opportunity for some storms, a few of which could pack a punch with strong to severe wind gusts and hail. Storm predictor for your Thursday morning, though, lingering showers moving on out. Could see a few shower storms further off to the north, but our attention then turns to Thursday night on into Friday with another opportunity for strong to severe weather. So your severe outlook, and this has been updated since we last spoke, seeing most of the area with an isolated chance for large severe hail and damaging wind gusts in excess of 60 miles an hour. Thursday night, much of the same higher risk further off into the east. And once again, for your Friday along and south of Interstate 80, large hail, damaging winds, your primary concerns. Impact weather icons tonight, Thursday night, Friday, Saturday for storms. But today, it's for the heat, 96 your high this afternoon, feeling like 101, though some communities further south could feel as hot as 105. We'll see uh, temperatures a little bit cooler. We'll take the 80s as we head into the weekend, drying things out by Sunday.